Good morning. Hi, my name is Jay Gross, and I am your son or daughter's English teacher. And English 12 is, we're down to three weeks. So I'm just touching base real quick here to let you know that no one should fail this class if they're going to put forth the effort. Uh, the two things I've seen that put kids at risk are attendance, not coming, and basically not doing anything and turning, uh, turning assignments in. So what I wanted to do with this real quick was touch base and let each and every one of you know that there's a possibility every single one can pass. So now if you look right here on the screen, underneath week 14 right here, we're just coming off prom weekend. Anything that you see that's in red is a due date as we take a peek at it. So like tomorrow, there's going to be a research quick check. I've broken it into sections and that's not coming due until next week. The poetry project is coming up due by 3 p.m this coming Friday. That research paper I talked about is coming up due Tuesday the 2nd by 3 p.m. Then we go into the later of the week, resume draft four, which we've been working on. This is for a final grade. I actually started this back in September with them, and then I started it again in January with my new students. Three letters of rec were assigned back in September, and again in January, that they can have those due by 3 p.m. Uh, finally, that last week when it gets kind of crazy because their last day is on the 12th, we'll have the final poetry project due by Tuesday the 9th. We'll take a final test in class and get them through. Graduation's coming up on the 21st. What I want to show you over here to the left is my categories. Okay, so as we take a look, the group work, which is actually the research project, it doesn't have research or research project written for my choices, so I chose to use group work. That's 10% of their grade that's out there. The portfolio that's coming up is 10%. The projects that we have that all the other stuff will go into is worth 20. So as you start looking at it, there's 40% left out there along with the final test, which is 30. So 70% of their grade is still sitting out there. So even if they look like they're down with a very low percentage, they can still pass this class. When you look into Skyward, which I really highly encourage you to check out every Monday, you see these asterisks that say missing assignments. Well, if you look and we go across here, when we start looking, the research project is right here. The poetry project's right here. Those are all coming due dates. Just like as we get into final resume, three letters of rec, final test, final portfolio, as we look at all this stuff, these are all the coming assignments where they can really do some damage for their grades. They can really get it up there. So if we could do what I love to say is this triangle, if you look at a triangle with the student at the top, we're at the bottom, the educational system, the school, and then the parents. Let's keep those sides level so that we're all working to get these kids through because you've got some great kids. And I'm sending this out as a blanket statement, not to single anybody out, but if you need to get a hold of me, I'm real easy to find. You can email me at jgross at morleystanwood.org or you can get a hold of me. The kids all have my phone number. It's at the top of Google Classroom and you could call the school. So uh, we are so close, people. 15 days, and I don't count that last day, so we're down to about 14 days of their high school career. Let's get them through together. Thank you very much for your time today.